All right, so here's the game page. Let's go search up tower. Oh my god, tower defense. Bro, I can't type. Okay, there we go. Tower defense, and let's just go into experiences. So first off, we got tower defense simulator, obviously. Defender's Depot, pixel gun tower defense, and all of these tower de This is not tower defense. All we need to do now is look for the lowest rated tower defense game here. Like, see, TDS has 93% rating. And that is definitely not the lowest one. If we go down, there's already Tower Heroes with 88. Of course, there's some games like this, Mining Simulator 2, which aren't even a tower defense game, but damn, that's pretty highly rated. All right, so I see this Untitled Tower Defense game, and to the left of it, 49% on Toy Defense, and it actually has players. And 49 right here is the lowest one so far. I'm probably going to scroll down. Of course, it still has to have players. If it doesn't have, like, any players, then that doesn't really count, because then it probably has barely any ratings. But let me just open this right here real quick. And, and you can see that more people disliked it than liked it. And you can see that's an actual, like, big number. There's 6.4 million visits on this game. As compared to if we just scroll randomly down, click on, like our hidden wave defense open it in a new tab and then yeah like 38 i don't know if i can really consider this a tower defense game because this is uh, you know what yeah you know let's try it what the heck um okay let's see is there audio okay so i have six hundred thousand dollars um i can place down an enforcer uh let me max it out oh my god it's raz uh what the heck is this? Okay, we have a John. Uh, we have a crook boss. Is that a crook boss? We also- What? Th that's the stupidest farm model I've ever seen. Okay, let me place down a few more, uh, a few more of these Johns because, uh, well, we're gonna die to Raz. Would you look at this? We got- What the heck spawned this? We have a Jeep that is drifting sideways. Was it this? This is definitely a farm, though. I guess it was probably the crook boss then. Wait, most important test. Does it bounce? Nah, this game is a scam. Now it makes complete sense why this was only rated 47. And oh my god, that is so many more enemies than there were last week. We went from beating one Raz to having to beat, like, I can't even count that. Well, maybe if I was ready, I would have been able to prepare some defenses for this. Oh my god, that's so bright. So how exactly is this hidden wave if this is the second wave? Yeah, hidden wave is supposed to be one wave. And we're gonna die. Does anything happen when we die? Car? Oh, come on. Well, at least they got some mechanics to work. Like, the car actually hits enemies and the towers sort of work. They probably just used, like, a tower defense game kit or something. But yeah, I wouldn't really count... Wait, are enemies gonna come out? You were kicked from this experience. You so this is how you lose in this game. You get kicked. Okay. So I don't know if I can count that because it's not technically an official tower defense game. It's just some random kit thrown together and still the lowest one i saw here was toy defense because this like look at this there's badges what the heck they're like all not loaded but yeah there's actually badges there's updates here it's made by what seems to be a group that actually has developers in it let's see uh vip i uh, should definitely be on here because i'm about to play their game and it's probably gonna get like three extra players and they have five developers okay so yeah their game is um i don't even know i can't really comment on it let's play it it's gotten an update a week ago so that's already that's already one to zero on tds and oh my god i just what the heck is going on i'm loading build delete excuse me is this game working no what what the hell is happening well if this if this is what the game is then it clearly makes sense as to why it's so disliked is this a tycoon what is Oh, finally! Glacid Games. Um, here we are. What is... Wait. Wait, what? The heck do I do? Okay, I have a block. I can place the block and I can delete the block. Uh-huh, okay. I'm on plot number three, but I don't know what any of this is. Shop, wooden lunchbox. What? What is going on? I'm concerned right now. Waves. Wave one. Oh! I think that sends it out. Wait, is this like a build and survive sort of game and not an actual tower defense game? Why am I so fast? Let me get inside. Let me get in these. You never mind. I'm just going to build around myself. That's all my blocks. Uh, and I get a soldier. Okay, let's place him right here. This is, uh, this looks amazing. What do I do? Waves. One. Oh, okay. Here's stuff actually comes. This sounds like a TDS soundtrack playing in the background. It's making me think of night three and my soldier is dead. Um, it's not good. What What do I have to do? Not, they're just breaking the blocks. Wait. Wait. Oh my god. Is that a gun? 
I don't think this is a gun because I can't actually do anything. Did I beat the wave? What happened? I... Uh, oh my god. Bear with me as I try to figure this whole thing out. What do we got in here? Um, a lake. That came from a leaking faucet, probably. Okay. Let's go back over to this river thing because this might be important. I'm thinking maybe build like a platform for my soldier to oh my god what am i doing build like a platform for my soldier to stand on let's put him on top that way he'll hopefully be shooting things down as he's on there oh and this thing is um where the enemies come from i guess oh wow i guess it does sort of work like that I, the, yeah see the soldier is taking a shot and i might have is this just a way to cheese it oh never mind the blocks fall for a second i thought the soldier was gonna stay on top the blocks weren't going to fall. What the heck? That makes no sense. Oh, I won. Let's go. Um, I got 0 0.1, 0 0.01 crackers. Is it, That looks like a cracker to me. A very dirty one. I guess it's like some sort of lunch. I don't know who this puppy guy is. I'm going to let them join. I mean, maybe it's so poorly rated because it's there's absolutely no indication of what you're supposed to do. My guy's already building. Um, so I guess I should probably get started as well. Um, I don't know what he's doing. He's either really good at this game or just like me, barely knows what he's doing. I'm thinking, what if I make like a long sort of tower? Uh, yeah, that is not sus at all. Uh, and then place the soldier right on top. I don't know what this sort of structure is meant to do. All right, let's go send out the second wave. Uh, his structure kind of fell apart there. Okay, so enemies can come from there. And from there this is essentially a very very slow firing soldier and oh my god what a landing uh what i'm going to be so confused this game Ooh, okay we have just one enemy left and one soldier let's hope this oh uh, yay okay what is what is store D why is this so expensive double crackers i can save i guess Hmm. This game makes me think of like one of those build to survive games where you kind of got to build blocks and you have a gun and as the enemies like run towards you, you have to shoot them down. But you're trying to build something like that. Actually, I kind of liked my structure last time. Give me those. Can I delete his blocks? Okay, I can't delete his blocks. This guy is wondering if I'm a YouTuber. Yes. Um, I, I, I wonder what could have given that away. Either way, uh, let me figure something out. Maybe if I build like a, a staircase. That'll be good. I want to try building something like this, you know, keep the keep the structure stable, as stable as possible, so that my soldier from up here can um, shoot as many times as possible. Let's send out the third wave. It's a really different approach from a normal tower defense game, but I kind of like this unique idea. Oh my god, my soldier is falling. Again, these sort of one-of-a-kind tower defense games are pretty interesting. It's not exactly well made. Like, you can tell the UI is probably, like, some free images on the Roblox catalog, but the mechanics are actually kind of fun. Okay, here we go. Let me place my toy soldier. Let's see what this um, uh, puppy guy is going to do. He's going to place his soldier right next to mine. Okay, he's building up. Uh, let's see what he's going to do. Oh, I think he's just going to make a much bigger tower. Okay, yeah. I was going to tell him to place more blocks at the base, but looks like he got the idea. Okay, teamwork. That looks like it's going to hold up pretty well. Let's send out the fourth wave. Can you push the enemies? Because... Oh, we won. We're too good for this. Uh, why is this stuff so expensive? Okay, it doesn't appear like we have any more teamwork now. Uh, yeah, let's not do that. What if we make a sort of like elevated platform is what I'm thinking next. We got another guy and um, it appears as though we're going to need him because this is tough. And I guess... Uh, the other dude doesn't really want to listen to me. Okay. Well, in that case, I'll just build the same structure as last time. Uh, the, the tall box thing or whatever. Oh my goodness. Wow. This guy's a god. I don't know what he's doing, but what whatever he's doing, that's freaking... That's going to help. I'm kind of... I'm kind of wanting to send out the wave before they even have a chance to finish that. All right. Let's go. Wave five. Let's 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 see how difficult it gets now. There's probably gonna be like I don't even know 20 enemies. They're all rushing to get that one block. I guess they're not really as weird going for the soldiers as they are going for the blocks. And um, well, this army in here is clearly able to handle things 
really well. There you go. That was a very easy win. Uh, let's see. Wooden lunchbox. I guess the thing we're getting is called the recruit because it's like the very basic one. I really doubt that the soldier that you get from this crate, which is pretty expensive. I doubt that's this, especially seeing as the fire is so slow. Let's open a lunchbox. Interesting animation. I don't even know what it gave me. Ooh, it gave me, okay, five, five wood. I can try making my uh, table now uh, that I was wanting to earlier. You know what? That's not exactly a table, but it's going to work. Let me place my soldier on top or recruit because I don't actually know if that's a soldier. And then it doesn't seem like anybody's waiting for anything. Let's start the wave. I don't get it. How is it not obvious? It seems like there's no enemy stronger than these basic guys with a knife, which kind of uh, eliminates the challenge here because uh, it's just a spam of enemies. And this might as well just be the best strategy ever because as the enemies run to attack, well, uh, they are going to attack the blocks and soldiers in the center are going to wipe everything out. Or recruits. I still don't know what these are. There's no indicator on them. At this point, I think I've seen enough for a game with five developers. Uh, this clearly is um, not really quality. I can say I do like the idea of having to like build your own structures as the enemies try to take them down. That is pretty unique. Why is this guy taking so many shots? But as I'm saying, it is pretty unique. And if the developers were to actually add more difficult enemies, probably more towers and not such difficult ramping where you're going from like three enemies to like 15 in just a couple levels. Either way, again, that's literally the lowest like rated actual tower defense game here that I can see. Would I say the game deserves a 49%? Uh, probably actually. Again, not because like the mechanics are bad or anything. I'm liking the idea, but being honest here, there's not really a lot to worry about in your gameplay. Spam some of these guys and that's just a win. No matter how many enemies, because they're so far spaced apart. Even if there were like 500 in one wave, they'd be spawning so slowly with this amount of soldiers or recruits, they'd be reloading quick enough to take literally everything down. Well, that was it for the lowest rated tower defense game, at least that I could find. So like, subscribe, you start code E, and see ya.